If you would like to support the channel, please consider becoming a patron on Patreon. More information in the description below. Oh, hello guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Welcome back to Undertale, question mark. Oh, so I learned through review and intense study that the uh, 76 or whatever it was was not the time or the hours or anything like that. It was just how many minutes I'd been playing. So where do we leave off? Hold on, let's get... Oh, okay. It's all coming back to me. Now, uh, we were doing ch faith, right? Here's the issue. Wrong way. I couldn't get the controller to work with faith, so we're playing Undertale today. What is this? What is this? Saves. I don't need to save. Hi, who are you? Oh, okay, wait, wait, okay. So the voices are always inconsistent. Haven't you seen the guy with two jobs before? Unfortunately, two jobs mean twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to grail base. Want to come? Hell yeah, I do. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here, I know a shortcut. I once had a, a turkey burger that had a compote. I think it's called a compote. It's like a blackberry compote, bacon, Swiss cheese, and sharp cheddar. Oh man. Oh man. Let me tell you, I became a woman that day. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone! Oh, it's the murder dogs. Hey, Sans. Greedy Sans, hi, Sans. Ooh, hi, Sansy. Hi, Sansy. Hey, Sans, were you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Does he eat? Nah, I've had a breakfast. In oh, nah, I've had breakfast in at least an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Oh, stop it. Hey, get comfy. <clears throat> Watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopsie, whoopsie, whoopie cushions on seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Mmm. Can I have both? Why not both? I guess fries for now? Just so that, like, as I'm going, all the fat from the burger doesn't cascade down my intestines and I get like intense diarrhea? Does that happen to anyone else? Or am I just old? Hey, that sounds pretty good. Grailby, we'll have a double order of fries. Can I have sweet potato fries? Thank you. So, what do you think? Oh, my brother. Oh god, okay. That g the brother's voice frightens me because it's the sh it's so loud, I think he's yelling all the time. It's really, it's hard to tell. But man, that voice, it jacks up my throat. Um, he's, he's, he's okay. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you wore, out, wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Is he a never nude? Well, at least he washed it. Okay, good. And by that, I mean he was, okay, well, that, that. Hold on, my game collapsed. For some reason, I don't know why it does that. Uh, he wears it in the shower. Here comes a crop. Want some ketchup? Are you gonna spill it on me? Yeah, I love ketchup. Bon appetite. Tip the ketchup. Cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bottle pours into the food. Whoops. How did that even happen? That's that's a my bad. Ah, hey, forget about it. You're gonna have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries really hard. He does try hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the royal guard. One day, he went to the house of the head, head of the royal guard, and he begged her to let him be in it. And of course, she shut the door on him, because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, uh, still a work in progress. You don't say. I never would have guessed. Oh, yeah, I wanted to ask you something. My hand in marriage? No. Sorry. Have you ever... Wait, have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yeah, flowey. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them, and they'll repeat it over and over. Oh. 
So that wasn't actually the flower talking? What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement. Predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Oh, there's something deeper at play here, huh? Well, that was a long break. Can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm Flapro. Can you foot the bell? It's just... No, I can't. I'm a child. Just kidding. Grilby, put it on my tab. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. Okay, so just leave. Can I have the french fries, at least? Uh, Grills... Grill... Grillbiz said that your food is probably cold by now. Okay. Where did I... Where did... Where did we go? Where did we come from? Where did we go? We went this way and we went up, right? No, we went all the way across. Because up led to a weird spot. Hold on. Hold on. This. Somebody, like, called me? And played a song or something? Or I don't remember. It was a while ago. In in my time, I played this, like, quite a long while ago. I have recorded part of another Let's Play in that time, which... Huh, I'm not gonna tell you what it is unless you ask me really, really nice. We did some faith. Man, my Zilly. Let me tell you. Okay, the library. Has been very, very ill. Papyrus. Part of that illness is she didn't poop for about a week. And she pooped yesterday. It was it was dramatic, but let me tell you. I I am relieved. I am relieved that she pooped. The sheer quantity of it. God. So you came back to have a date with me! You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. Wait, what? I didn't agree to a date, did I? A place I like to spend a lot of time. Your bathroom? Your sock palace? What are you what are we doing? Okay, buddy. You just My house Moments like that Moments like that deserve a face cam because that was just What the fuck, dude? Uh what's going on up there? This is actually pretty chill. This is my brother's pet rock! He always forgets to feed it! As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. Okay. Oh. Well, that's kind of neat. I'm uh, impressed. I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look -see. You can fit more bones? <gasps> Who's a sweet boy? What? Catch that meddling canine! Sorry, no can do, buddy. Cassis? Stop it. What is this slapstick bullshit? Sans! Stop plaguing my life with an incidental music! <clears throat> uh huh, just in my feud museum. Feud museum? Oh no. Peruse my culinary art show. Half the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Okay. We're not talking about stuff from the 1980s. My brother always comes out to eat, but recently he tried break baking something. Ooh. It was like a quiche, but filled with a sugary, non-eggy substance. So not at all like a quiche. How absurd. Ooh, video game. Video game. Let me have it. It's a dirty sock with a... A dirty sock with a series of notes on it. I thought it was a video game. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You move it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still... Okay. Okay, boys. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget about it. I thought that was a video game. That's... <gasps> 
My favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. Why? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. Okay. Do you see things in the static, buddy? Uh, a joke book? Take a look inside. Oh, is this gonna hurt? Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. Hmm. That's my realm! If you finish looking around, we could go in and... Do whatever people do when they date. <clears throat> Sorry, I just punched my microphone. Just, I'm just gonna get comfortable for this one. I'm a grown-ass thought. I'm a grown-ass thought. What do you think's gonna happen in that room? Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to. Classic image. Oh, it all reminds me. What's a part in life? Bones. Door's locked. Uh, okay. That's my room. Finish looking around. Go in and... Alright. Alright. Hey. Like, I like your car. <gasps> you have a race car bed? Are you five? Oh, he's like Buster from Arrested Development, isn't he? I get it now. I get it now. That's my bed! If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin, of course. That's just a dream. So sad I cruise while I snooze. Was this your sock collection? Those are all the attacks I use on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it basically just happened. I hate doing your voice. It changes every time I do it. The only consistent thing is it's loud. Ah, yes, action figures. Oh, a great reference for the theoretical battle, battle scenes. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa. So, any Nurgle in here? Papa Nurgle loves you. Isn't that flag neat out? Undyne found it by the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Okay, buddy. Whew. That book, that book, that book's one of my favorites. I don't know why that took me so many tries. <laughs> Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. The next book's another one of my favorites. Pink a boo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. <clears throat> the internet, I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double digit follow account. Wow, look at you. Of course, fame has a, has a steep price. A jealous troll has been besieging my online persona. Always sending me bad puns and a goofy font. You're one of those people, it's like, I just want to be left alone. I can't take all the publicity. Meanwhile, they have like a couple hundred followers and they don't really have like a YouTube channel. There's You you see the episode of uh, South Park recently? You know what, maybe let's not date the program. But anyways, there's an episode of South Park about uh, Prince Harry and his and his wife Megan. I don't remember the last names or anything. But man, it real it's really on the nose when it comes to a lot of online creators. There are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me sometimes. <laughs> Get it? Look in the closet. Sure. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Oh. Oh, pleasant surprise. Okay, can we be done? So, um, if you've seen everything. You want to start the date? I guess. Okay, dating start! Am I gonna beat the shit out of him? Here we are on our date. I've actually never done this before. Don't worry! You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating role book from the library. We're here to have a great time. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press the C. 
by the on the key ah uh, reel it in wednesday dog crime population egg wow i think we're ready for step two step two ask them on a date <clears throat> human i great papyrus we'll go on a date with you i guess that's a way to ask really woo woo i guess that means it's time for part three step three put on clothes that are that to show that you care Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandana around your head. Yeah, we're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, by the today you were also wearing clothing! Woo woo! No, could it be? You voted to date me from the very beginning! Oh, uh, what do I say? Are we in combat? Do I be nice? Yeah? <gasps> I've seen that look before. Oh. Yeah, I've also seen that look before. No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! Your dating power! Yeah! Yeah! Don't think you best. Are we fighting? I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating and never will! I can easily keep up with you! You see? I, too, can wear clothing! In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Please keep them on. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold. Oh boy, buddy. Um. Oh boy. What do you think of my secret style? I love it. No. A genuine compliment. However, you don't truly really understand the hidden power of this outfit. I don't. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further. Oh, darn. Unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Oh, God. Eh. Oh, we're just going to avoid that area. Okay? We're just going to avoid that area. No, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. Oh, oh, I have to push a button. I thought it was going to flash at me. My hat! My hat! My hat! Ah! Well then, you found my secret. Did I? I suppose I have no choice. It's a present! A present! Just for you! Okay. Do you know what this is? I have no idea, buddy. That's right! You have no idea! Though it, this appears to be spaghetti. Of course. This ain't, an, an, this ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti, finely aged in oaken casks. Then aged by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this! There's no way this can go any farther. I guess I'll eat the spaghetti. I, I don't eat carbs is the thing. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. The taste is... Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have to do this voice. <clears throat> the, f the taste is indescribable. Let me sip my coffee. Mmm, delicious. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me. Oh, woo woo. Maybe even more than I do. No! No! Did you? Did you cream your pants, buddy? It's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, has all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. I'd fuck me. Would you fuck me? It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um. Boy, is it hot in here? Is it just me? Oh, shoot, human. I'm sorry. 
I don't like you the way you like me. Thank God. Romantically, I mean, I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Oh, no, buddy. Oh, no, buddy. Not, not even a little. Uh-uh. Then on the day, feelings would go, would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the Great Papyrus, have failed. Man, my voice is getting real jacked up and we're only 20 minutes into this, buddy. <clears throat> I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. Oh, don't, don't worry, bud. I'll find my way out. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait. That's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this never happened. After all, you're very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll, can we stop talking, bro? We just move this along. I'm fine. Everything is going to be A-OK. -okay. <sighs> I'll help you settle this. Settle for second best. Yeah. Oh. And if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, gotta go. Yeah. I appreciate that he was true to how he felt and he didn't waste any time because you should never waste your time with somebody that you don't have feelings for. Actually, I'm going to say that if you if you draw it out and you just kind of like waste each other's time, you're the asshole in that situation. You're not trying to be nice. You're just a fucking asshole. All right. Can I leave now? I never want to do the papyrus voice again. Whew. Ooh, what's going on here? Uh-oh. Ooh. Does this lead back to that save area that I was at? Oh, okay. Oh, my god. Save it. Save it, you dingus. Sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Whew. Man, that was definitely a sequence. Hi, bud. Let's hang out again sometime. I don't remember his name, but the guy with the jacket knows what's up. This is a box. You can put an item or take- Oh, 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 storage box. Why would you, though, you can't use items when they're in the box? True. Oh. Okay, is this gonna be a puzzle? Can I- Oh, we're good. We're Gucci. We're fine. <gasps> it's a flower. Now, okay, I remember the flower from the beginning. Was he telling me essentially that, like, the flower was just repeating what somebody else was saying? I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Oh. I'm, I'm so bad at these. I'm so, I'm so fucking great at these. Uh, there's a cam- a camera behind the waterfall. You don't say. What do you- okay, so what's it looking at? I can't go down these. Maybe I need to go get hit. Oh, I can't get hit. Oh, I'm a dingus. There's a camera behind the waterfall. Oh. 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 There's a tutu, a tutu lying on the ground like the ballerina thing, tutu. Got the old tutu, can I wear it? Hold on, hold on. Do I have a, there we go. Uh, an old, old tutu. Armor of 10, finally a protective piece of armor. Yes, why did you go away? Uh, use. Nice. All right, well, on we go. Ooh, why is this spooky? Oh. Oh, 
Shh. Hi, Un Undyne. I'm here for my with my daily report. Regarding that human I called you about earlier. Uh, did I fight them? Y yes, of course I did. I, I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Well, no. I tried very hard, Undyne, but in the end, I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? Uh-oh. But Undyne, you, you don't have to destroy them. You see? You see? I understand. I'll, I'll help you in any way I can. Uh-oh. 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 Is this the big bad? Is this the one that was saying all that shit that the flower was repeating? <gasps> Get fucked on. Asshole. Hi, who are you? Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome! I'm so jealous! What did you do to get her attention? Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys! Oh, 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 buddy! Oh, he's fine. He bounces. Feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. Yikes. Oh, sit up straight. Ready? One, two, three. Posture check! Uh, when four bridges, four, when four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. They, these will sprout? Uh. The most complicated puzzle of all time. Nailed it. What? Oh my, who's this Chad? Aaron flexes in? Okay, I don't wanna hit, I don't wanna hurt anyone. Uh, uh, flex at him. That's right, make your pecs dance. You flex, Aaron flexes twice as hard. Attack increases for you too, uh oh. Flexing contest, okay, flex more. Smiley, wink. Flex all over you. Tip to the tank, not tip to the flaccid. Uh, Aaron is ready for more for your next flex. Flex. You flex harder. Aaron flexes thrice as hard. Nice. I won't lose though. Smile. Eh. Eh. Oh, oh, wow. I almost ate shit there. Aaron is ready for you to flex for your next flex. Okay. Okay. He flexes very hard. Flexes himself out of the room. No. My best friend. So, I'm not getting any XP. I don't know what that means in the context of this game. I assume I don't need to fight. Oh yeah, that's right. I just yawned into the microphone. Uh, if an error is made, the bell blossom can call bridge seeds back to where they started. Woo, wow. Uh, okay, I just need to get over. Excuse me. Why is this music go so hard? I am at a com I'm at a complete loss on this. Oh my god, I've been here so long. Okay. I've been here forever and a day. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. Yeah. So, what do you win? Not the first time I've been asked that. <laughs> I'm asking for a friend! Also, not the first time somebody said that. She thought she saw you wearing a dusty tutu. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty tutu? No. So you aren't wearing a dusty tutu. Got it. You're, from, you're my friend, so I trust you 100%. Have a nice day! You manipulative cuntbag. I'm on to your shit. You think you can fool me? I'm not gonna censor it. You know why? Nobody censors me. Unless it's me. 
A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now all we are, now all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Oh, that's kind of sad. The wishing room. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. What does that mean? Woshua? All right, what do you want, Woshua? Uh, let's check. Uh, this humble germ germaphobe seeks to cleanse the whole world. Okay, okay. Whistle as it. Okay, okay. You got it, buddy. <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, friends with a little bird. He's a germaphobe, so clean. You ask Woshua to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Green means clean. <gasps> eh. 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 Oh no. Wonders if tears are sanitary. Probably not. Okay. They taste delicious, though. Friends, the little bird. Should I be getting the green? Let me, let me, let me run my face into the green things. All right, all right. Eh, eh. Eh. Oh, I missed. Friends of the little bird. Okay, now we can spare. 25 gold, I am rich. Come on, sis, make a wish. I wish my sister and I will see the real star someday. Look through the telescope, hell yeah. Wait, what does that say? Check wall? Oh. Oh, okay. Me. Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. Check the wall, like right here. Check the wall. Oh. Oh. Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words. The war of humans and monsters. Hold on, sit up straight. The war of humans and monsters. <gasps> Tell me more. Lore! Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would make the soul, uh, it would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body, even after death. Okay. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about the drawing. Wait, so haven't... It sounded like from, what was her name? Muriel? Turiel? Um, at the beginning of the game, it sounded like human children had come through here quite a few times. Oh, I can't go this way? Okay. So who's been getting the human souls? Or do they turn into the monsters eventually? Oh. Is that why un Oh, is that why Undyne is looking looking for the kid? Uh-oh. 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 Oh, 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 I can move, I can move, I can move. Eh, eh, I wasn't paying attention. I was ready for some lore. I was ready for some lore. Okay. I should probably heal. <gasps> Woo. Woo, oh. Eh, eh. Okay. Eh, ah. No, no, I need to eat a donut or something. I have so much money. Oh, you can't take it to the grave though. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait. <gasps> I can't, I can't, I can't. I gotta go. Oh, 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 oh. Hide, bitch. Hide, bitch. Uh, wait, I can't go any farther. Did I just get decapitated? Holy shit, dog! 
Uh oh! Did this- Uh oh! Is this where it turned into a dark horror game? Yes, please. Yo, she fucking decapitated that kid! Oh, he's fine. Yo, did you see- Did you see that? And I just- Ugh, she touched me! Okay, she didn't decapitate you. I'm never washing my face ever again! Man, are you unlucky! If you were standing just a little to the left, yo! Don't worry about it, I'm sure we'll see her again. I'm not gonna lie, I thought that went to a really dark place. And I was kind of all about it. What is this? Cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown over it. It's stuck to the table. What's the best kind of cheese? And I don't know if I'm saying it right. I, I, I struggle with words. I think it's called Munster. Munster? Man, I, I love, ooh, I love Munster cheese. Stuck to the table. Well, peel it off. Squeak. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crystal, it fills you with determination. Hell yeah, save it. On we go. Uh, an odd looking telescope. I'm looking back at into the telescope business. It's normally 50,000 gold to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Hell yeah, use a telescope. Hmm. All I see is pink. Or red. I don't know. Part of me suspects that maybe I don't see colors properly. That's a problem for me and my doctor, though. Nothing? No one? Anything? I would have paid 50,000 gold for this, buddy. You gotta work on your business model. Ah, you all satisfied. Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. Um, you a little cutie patootie. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? All of the above. Uh, let me look in here first. Hold on, hold on. Wait, what happened to my... My eyeball? Oh, I'm jacked up, aren't I? Uh... A stick... You... What is this? Uh... A single-pronged popsicle. Wait, that's just a normal... Okay, use it. Very good. Oh, sorry, I keep bumping my microphone. I hope that doesn't come through too loud. I relocated my store, but there's still no customers. Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy a nice ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for free nice ice cream. They're sure to get customers to come back. Hell yeah, bro. Just 25 gold? I'll take one. Super, here, here you go. Your cards are the box. You got the nice ice cream. Uh, the ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. Mm. What is the best ice cream flavor? It, I, you know what? I feel like maybe that's an unfair question. Would it not change from day to day, minute to minute, hour to hour? Because right now, something with like, like, brownie pieces and caramel sounds really good. But who knows how I'll feel in an hour? Could be, could be cookies and cream. Oh, cookies and cream is just a solid choice. Could be, could be rainbow sherbet, even though nobody likes rainbow sherbet. Take a card, take a card. Okay, I gotta remember, if I get a nice ice cream, go get a punch card. Could be scrambled eggs and bacon flavored ice cream. Who knows? Minute to minute, hour to hour. <gasps> How do I get to you, buddy? I will save you and make you my best friend. Ooh. Wait, where am I? What is this place called? You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? Mmm, what wish would I make? Honestly, I would probably go the very generic route. 
If I couldn't wish for like a superpower, I would probably just wish for money. Uh, you hear a passing conversation? Hmm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. What does that mean? If I could wish for any superpower? Oh, these guys. Oh, can I just like, can I just spare them? Oh. I can just spare them. Cool. It would be the ability to make, oh. Pring. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very murdery. I knew it. Well, why not, dear human? Papyrus would never betray you. You said you were not wearing a dusty tutu. So, of course, I actually told her you were indeed wearing a dusty tutu. Damn it. It pay me to tell such a bold-faced lie, but since you aren't wearing a dusty tutu, she surely won't attack you. Now you're safe and sound. Wowie, this is hard. I just want to be everybody's friend. Oh, buddy, that's not how life works. You can't be everyone's friend, nor should you, because some people just fucking suck. Click. I would want the ability to uh, make people feel fear. If I could choose, like, a very... Not practical, because, you know, superpowers aren't practical. But you can't be, like, Superman, right? Because that's boring. You can't have, like, all the powers. You get to choose just one. What do you choose? I would choose the ability to make people feel fear. There's nothing you couldn't do. Uh, you hear a passing conversation. Don't, don't say that. Come on, I promise I won't laugh. What? Nunny. The power to take their souls. This is the power that humans feared. Oh. Well, that's a pretty good thing to be afraid of. Oh. Hi. You happy to see me? You just happy to see me? You want to come over here and talk to me? Okay. Well, this suddenly doesn't look good. I have a... It's not impractical fear, I don't think. I have a deep aversion to water. Hey there! Noticed you were here. I'm Onion Sand. Onion Sand, you're here. Okay. You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's it's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Oh, woo woo! Okay, bye. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit sit down all the time, but hey, hey that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. Okay, bye. And the aquarium's full. Hey, anyway, so even if I wanted to, I, that's okay, though. You, you hear a nun's gonna fix everything you hear. I'm gonna... Get out of here and leave in the ocean, you hear? Okay. Hey, hey there, that's the end of this realm. I'll, I'll see you around. Have a good time in Waterfall. All right. Ooh, what are you? Shiren hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyways. Shiren. Uh, I guess check. Tone deaf. She's too ashamed to sing her deadly song. Oh. Toot. I don't know if I've ever, like, I'm pretty sure I've mentioned this a little, like, on stream. I was, a, uh, I pro played professionally in a big band for years. So anytime someone's like, I love music, I'm a musician, it really sparks up my interest. Maybe conduct? Can you guess what instrument I played in, in the professional big band? Toured quite a lot too. Uh, you wave your arms wildly. They, you are now vulnerable to electric attacks. What? Um. Bling. Bling. Taps a little beat with her fin, okay. Uh, hum? Oh, God. Shiren follows your melody. Okay. 
Oh, 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 oh. Never gonna catch me! <laughs> ah, Shyron seems almost more comfortable. Cool. Cool. Get out of here. 30 gold. Can you guess what instrument I played? The northern room hides a great treasure. I still have my instruments, too. I could probably go pick one up and play. I won't, I won't give you any hints. Uh, power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's- Wait, this power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. Dis disappears. And an incredible power would indeed- An incredible power would be needed to take the soul of the living monster. Wow. There's only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death. If only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened. And now it never will. What? Why not? Hmm. Getting some real Hollow Knight vibes here. It's a statue. The structure's at its feet... Oh, the structures at its feet seems dry. Hmm. Please take one. Take an umbrella? Hell yeah. Take an umbrella. Are we Gucci? Oh, that's nice. Do I have a reflection? I do have a reflection. Hey, kid. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome! Yeah, buddy, let's go! You can hang with me. What am I gonna call you? Gerbil. Come on, Gerbil. You're my best friend. Why are you out here? This doesn't really seem safe. Man, Undyne is so cool! She beats up bad guys and never loses! If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night! No, and she was going to beat me up. Okay, you have a... You know, as you grow up, you will learn more about the things that you like and don't like. Apparently, you really like getting booped on the snoot. And you know what? That's fine. Just don't take it too far, buddy. So you're going to stay with me, huh? So one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king! Man, what was this guy's voice? I am not good with voices I'm discovering. At least not keeping track of them. Uh, the king! We all had to call him Mr. Dreamer. Volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. And that got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. Yeah, but... Yeah, bud. She would beat up all the teachers. Uh, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. No, she wouldn't. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Ooh. Yeah, what is this? Oh, oh, sorry. Is that my goal? Didn't the lady in the beginning... Uh, didn't she say that there was a way out of the mountain past the castle? Like a cave near the castle? Put it back. Thank you! Yo! This ledge is too steep! I don't know why he keeps getting higher and higher. You want to see Undyne, right? Climb on my shoulders! Cool. Oh, climb... Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Okay, bye. Oh. I actually don't really want to see Undyne. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. Really? Me. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too uh, powerful and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken and countless monsters were turned to dust. The sound of muffled rain on the uh, K 
cave top, it fills you with determination. Hell yeah. Alright, we've been going for a bit. I'm gonna stop it there. I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys. Bye.